All right, folks, I already know what time it is. It's time to get us back into some Pixelmon. I am excited because there's a lot that's happened on the server since uh, since I was last year. So we're just going to direct connect to the old server. Let's get it. Check out. So, so shout out to <laughs> Fantastical Fish. They really, really changed the game. My house is now um, cool. Like I, could, I would not have built this by myself. All my houses end up looking like shoeboxes, and that's just the way it goes. But <laughs> I also I have my shiny shiny geodude with me, of course. Let me send this boy out so you guys can just let me just flex him real quick. Shiny dude, just chilling, looking strong. Uh, so there's there's been a lot of changes out here. Check this shit out. We somebody went hard on this. We have a massive logo up there. The boo oversees the city. So this is our this is our city. I'll, I'll, I'll put the the coordinates um, in the description of YouTube YouTube video. If you'd like to come and you know stake a claim out here, it's we got some we got some open space. We've definitely had some new residents come in. This is my buddy James's house. Just about the worst one here. There's also a big Paul. I freaking love him. Whoever who was it that did this? Like a lighthouse over here. There's some. Whoa! Hold up, you guys. That have joined me on this server have gone crazy. Look at this. Oh my god. Dude. What? This is just right in my city. Look at you can see the you can see the boo from about as far away as hell. That'll be if I ever get lost, you, you just look for the big uh <laughs> the big pixel boo. Look at this Coliseum. This has gotta be like this, this is insane. Let's go, let's go in there. I don't know how this looks nice. So my community has really gone hard when it comes to building. How do you even begin to like do this? There's just random chests and stuff, but what is going this is do I just jump down there? I'm afraid I'm not gonna be able to like get my way back. What oh okay, yep, I'm in. And nearly dead. <laughs> There's just some wild Pokemon in here too, which is actually crazy. This is the coolest thing ever. So I can just like yeet out my Geodude and just flex on this normie boy right here. Yeah, look at that. I bet you wish you were mustard yellow. Huh? How about that? Ooh, somebody's got a Primarina. Dude. You guys have level 100 Lugias? And I was not... Why is it... Uh, what have you done to this Lugia? Why does it look like that? Oh, uh-oh. Sleek Zeke wants to battle. Um, I don't know if I have a, an acceptable team for this. I'm gonna... We'll try, though. Okay, Geodude's out in front against... Level 70 Buzzwell, who's nearly dead though. So alright, Geodude. Now's your time to time to shine, buddy. Oh, okay. Hammer arms me and and I'm dead. So yeah. Um <laughs> I also have this hair across with me. I should not I should not be in this fight. This is a terrible idea. Switches out, goes into the Glyscore. Level 36, so it comes in on a on a hydro pump, and I just hit that homie. It, sorry about that, buddy. I can't let my mons get slaughtered like this. You guys have you guys have gone hard. This Melmetal is on fire. What happened to Melmetal? Also, how do I get out of this? Uh, how do I get out of here? Look at... Oh, there's even a little healing machine right here, too. In the Colosseum, you can just get your ass whipped, come over, and then just grab a heal. So, you know. Crates. All right. Who's ready to go get something cool? I have a, a rare crate key this time. This is a different one than I've done before. Uh, so here's the rare crate. All right, almighty Alakazam. I need I need your blessing here, buddy. Let's do it. Oh, we get. Oh Lord, what what even is all this stuff? If I would have just got seven diamond pickaxes, honestly, not bad. I got twenty five hundred um, claim blocks, which uh, I don't know how to use. What, what does this mean? Is this good? Do I like this? I got claim blocks, boys. What is that over? Oh, there's a vehicle just flying by. Oh, somebody riding that thing. Just somebody just, you know, just going for a nice little ride on their, uh, on their bug. That guy's riding a mankey. No, it's an Infernape, just kidding. That is the small, sir. You have a very small Infernape, just letting this thing run all crazy. I like him, though. You're not gonna believe what someone freaking built over here, man. What? You are not gonna believe. This is my city? Okay, but wait. Check this shit out. Look at this. An arena? <laughs> yeah. Holy shit. What the so was it Sleek Zeke? Oh, that boy just yeeted off. Oh, they're all going no down. Yeah, there's no fall damage? No fall damage. It took me down to you like started. one. Well, you're not gonna die. Yeah, the server's gonna reset. But yeah, it's a cool place to battle. Oh, yeet. Oh, you did die. Wow. What the fuck, man? <laughs> <laughs> What's happening? What are you guys doing in here? Are we all chilling? Is it a Rotom fan? Is it just a fan? 
Do I turn, do we, does the Rotom come later? How does this work? <laughs> oh my god, he's also got, of course. Of course, Trash has a Nagin Adele. Just flying away into the darkness. Nope, he's coming back. Oh, dude. That is so cool. I love him. All right, folks, we're going to see, we're going to figure out how you make balls. I already have a bunch uh, for our next endeavor, but we must find out the way. Show me the way. Just taking me down to the basement to show me how to make balls. Nothing, nothing uh, suspicious about this. So um, there's a bunch of different lids over here. We've got uh, some iron bases. Nice. I assume the bases are universal. Um, and then there's just a bunch of cooked apricorns. I believe you just cook apricorns, right? It's just a bunch of cooked ones. Nice. Uh, and then along with some stones and some buttons. So you believe you need three parts. You need the base, a button, and then the tops. Um, and so then over here we have finished products. So there's just a whole bunch of balls that are just like, I'll take, I'll take those two Pokeballs. I don't want to take the whole supply. But our city is just very friendly. We just got a, a crate just full, full of balls for you. Only on my, only in my city. Hello? What's happening? Okay, so here we have, this is how trades work here. I guess we, oh, nice. So, what do I want to, hold on, what, I'm not ready, I'm not ready. What do I want, what do you want for this thing, man? How about I give you, uh, let's see, what do I have? You're definitely not getting Bidoofus. That's for sure. How about a Machop? This is a fair trade, right? I'll give you a Machop. Choosing. I'm ready. Machop for Blacephalon? Fair trade. <laughs> Thank you very much for the trade. Look at that. It is a lollipop. Also kind of looks like a coronavirus or something. Alright, but it's time to it's time to it's time to go do some stuff. Let's let's warp. Here's what we're gonna do today. We're warping to Safari. Here we have the Safari. It works just like uh, Safari zones in regular Pokemon games. I believe there's just a whole bunch of different areas um, that have just kind of different habitats. But I have not fully explored in here before, so I'm excited to see kind of what they what they've got. I should probably put my sword away. I'm gonna I'm gonna scare away the locals. <laughs> uh, so you take a step inside. We've got some healing machines, some PCs, and here's where it breaks down breaks down the zone info. So there's four different zones. I am excited to see what's in here. We've got a whole bunch of Pokeballs. It's time to go catching, boys. So this first area is looking, looking. there is a Lapras over there. There's just a Stantler chilling, Heracross. I already got one of you, so you can stay. Um, oh my God, it's a Bufalant. This is crazy. Hello? Okay, this poor Pikipek is stuck in the water. No, he good, he good. You get out of the, get, get out of the way. You're gonna light on fire. Why is everything on fire? <laughs> Um, so this is like a whole different like forest area of the safari zone. This is crazy. Got just something flying by. There's a Kecleon. Where are the shinies at? So I assume, ooh, ooh. This looks like the angriest pincer ever. Wait, that one's small. There's a bigger one over here. Wait, a little bit bigger. Hey, buddy, level five pincer. Guess what? You're getting quick ball, Tommy. Dick pincer, you're coming with me. You are coming with me, buddy. <laughs> You already know I had to go to the Safari Zone and find myself a pincer. And we caught it. So that'll, that'll go to the old PC. Very nice. Whole different vibe going on over here. You got a waterfall. There's a binnacle, some core fish. Just, just a swab blue having a bath, you know? Also, wait, hold on. There was a Lapras somewhere and I, I got freaking sidetracked because everything's too too exciting. These Kamalas just rolling around. Oh my god, look at the Kamala animation. <laughs> he just be rolling around. Where's the, Where did that Lapras go, man? I don't know. I'm lost. I saw the Gyarados and then I, I got hella sidetracked. It was over here, wasn't it? That's a Mega Aerodactyl. Who? Hello? Should I be worried? Ooh, there's a Grimer. Hey, guess what, buddy? You're level six. Quick ball, yo ass. You're coming with me too. You know how I love my mucks. Oh my God, there's a Drampa over there too. Oh, you got out. Hey, get your ass back here, buddy. I don't want to have to tell you again. You're coming with me. So this is like the swampy kind of area, which is cool. Um, okay, this thing does not want to be caught. Please help. Oh, I accidentally dropped my ball. That's fine. This, this gives me. Uh, you guys remember in the, the the Great Marsh being stuck in the in the freaking the mud? That was like the worst thing ever. Luckily, not quite an, as annoying in this uh, in this mod, but 
Oh, oh God, where did he go? Did I catch him? Nope. Dude, how many quick balls does it take to catch a Grimer? We're about to find out. Entirely too many, apparently. So where did my ball go? Is it? Did it hop out? The Grimer's just gone. The Grimer hates me. There is so many Pokemon in here, it's overwhelming. This has got to be like the best place to shine. A couple of Drampaws. Just the weirdest Pokemon ever. But do I try to catch this thing? Let's, um... So we're getting in a battle with this thing because I feel like we have to battle the Drampaw. It's level 23. I don't know if my... Maybe we'll Ember it with Blissevelon. Okay, now that just kills it. Okay, listen, I'm sorry. I'm going to come with a better option here. Let's go Heracross. Um, and then we'll throw... Okay, I'll save you, buddy. Don't worry. <laughs> this thing is absolutely panicking. <laughs> He's like, get me out of here. <laughs> We've all been there, buddy. We've all been there. Let's, um... Let's Night Slash you one time. Okay, perfect. Perfect. It glares me. That's kind of annoying. Do I have Guts, though? Well, we're going to Night Slash. We'll see if... We'll see if I'm guts based off of this damage. Eh, no, no, it doesn't look like it. Okay. We've got this thing in yellow. Now let's go into Pokeballs. And let's eat. I have one Park Ball, which I don't know how I got that or what. I'm assuming this is good for the Safari Zone. <laughs> Come on, Park Ball. Make me proud. I captured him. All right. Got the Drampa on a Park Ball, boys. And that is how it's done. Tiniest Krogunk ever. We got a Gligar over here. Hey, listen, I don't like the way you're looking at me, buddy. Guess what? You're getting a ball thrown at your face. Come on. Come, come on. Damn it. And it's pretty crazy. I feel like anytime a Pokemon, if a Pokemon spawns and it's shiny, there's probably like a bunch of other people here, like ready to snatch it up. Look at this Psyduck. He's so, oh, we have the ice zone over here, boys. Which there is a rock to evolve your Eevee into a Glaceon, which is kind of cool. The Snowbird's just chilling by it, thinking, what the hell's that? There's a little Vanillite over here. There's a Jinx. Hold up. We've got to grab ourselves a Frosted too, right? That's just... Yes, okay. We're in a battle, and I'm going to tackle you once. And just kill it, because I'm level 23. God damn it. What happened to my mans? You're not looking so good, buddy. He has an enchanted bow, though, so you he, he look, looking kind of cool. There was a Lapras over here, and I'm upset that I missed it. Somebody stole the Lapras. The hell? There's got to be a new one, right? Where'd y'all put the Lapras? Hello? Was it you? Man. Is it Pukamuku? I just like exploring. Okay, here we have the desert area. This reminds me of home. This is... A, oh, okay. Titan just always flexing his Gyarados on us. This reminds me of home. What is... What's going on over here? We got a Garrottle. Guy's got a Garrottle. Freaking Garchomp. I really wish that was wild. Man, why y'all gotta send out your cool Pokemon? Thinking I can catch them and stuff. I wonder if I can actually... Can you, like, take the wood from in here? No. Okay, makes sense. Whoa! <laughs> Whose Legos are this? Whose Legos are these? <gasps> Ponyta! And a Poochiana. And a Growlithe. Hold up, I need the Growlithe. I have, I have some, like, Firestone shards that I could potentially figure out how to make that into a regular Firestone and then freaking... Yeah, nice! <laughs> Sometimes you just gotta catch a quick Growlithe and just be on your way. How about you, Pony? I need more fire types. Oops, I just threw the Pokeball at your ass, but hey, it worked. It worked. Got you in there. Got your ass in there. Come on. Nope. Okay. I honestly wouldn't mind a Rapid Ash. That seems like a, f a fitting Pokemon to ride around. What's up with that Starmie? Yeah, so there's something there's something weird about my Starmie. I got this thing from a, from a chest. Um, but look at my boy. Look at this Starmie. He's just a little bit emo. He's, uh, he's pretty cool. You can ride him fast in the water, but turns out he's not so good on land. Go take a look at our... At our first Safari Zone haul, which, you know, we didn't go too crazy. I just kind of wanted to see what that place was about, but let's take a look at the old PC. So, we got a pincer, of course. Let's take, a, let's take a look at old pincer here. What do you got for me, buddy? Got Mold Breaker. We are Hardy Nature. Neat. We got this Drampa, level 25. We got a Growlithe, Ponyta, Blitzel, Heatmore. And, now last but not least, this Pineco. So, you know, pretty great haul. Pretty great haul, not going to lie. We're going to put Pincer in front. Going to send his ass out. And, uh... We can ride the Pincer. Oh, he's pretty quick, too. He fast as hell. We flying. We flying on the Pincer. Our house, our, our freaking village has never been better. I mean, would you just look at the beauty of this place? We can go from... We got to hit the end with a nice clean view. With a massive Coliseum. 
And some cool trees and stuff. They even went, even went as far as to plant the flowers around here. Look at this. This could all be yours. <laughs> but it's mine, so heck off. <laughs>